So today I wanted to just give a quick overview of um, two of these um, lithium ion battery charger IC chips that I recently acquired and built up here. Um, this one on the left here is a uh, microchip SOT 23 package chip. And uh, this one on the did I say right? This one on the right here is um, a SOT 89 package from uh, Torex. And if you've never soldered hand soldered surface mount components before, the SOT 23 package may not be ideal for you. Even the SOT 89 is not too easy, but with a little practice, both of them are very possible to solder, hand solder. Um, so, basically, both of them require very few components, and I'll list the uh, part numbers also. But uh, you essentially have um, some sort of sense resistor that determines the uh, charging rate or amount of current used to charge the device. And the part, uh, the chips that I have, the Torx goes up to 800 milliamps and the um, microchip goes up to 500. And they're actually both really nice chips. Um, they both work out of the box really similarly actually. Um, here we have on the left we have the microchip one. We turn it on and we can see that it's almost at the end of its charge. It's drawing 60 milliamps from its max of uh, 500. And they both take, I think, something like, I think, I think the microchip works down to as low as maybe even three point something volts, where the uh, Torx one in the SOT89 package uh, goes down to as little as uh, 4.25 volts or something like that. Um, but for ease of use they're about the same except for the hand soldering um, and uh, just configured by default if you use one lead it'll be on during the charging sequence and then off when it's when it's done charging actually probably pretty soon it should turn off I don't know if if it'll be soon enough but um, yeah that's basically the quick uh, rundown on these two chips they're really nice I'll list the part numbers I got these both from DigiKey um, the uh, Torx one in the SOT89 package is I think it was like a dollar um, 60 something and then the microchip one in the SOT23 uh, package was pretty cheap at 67 cents I believe for quantities of one or uh, under under I don't know you know the the price break quantities are probably at least a thousand so um, but actually yeah I, I I did find the microchip one in the smaller package size to be pretty nice also um, despite the uh, lower uh, current capabilities of only 500 milliamp hours which is pretty decent if you're just doing single batteries so anyways, I'll list, uh, I'll list the part numbers below, and that's my uh, just quick overview of these two um, surface mount charger ICs. Thanks for watching.